do you guys want a timer on your screen or even a stopwatch for streaming or just content creating when you're recording your screen well you're in the right place i'm going to show you guys how you can add a timer or stopwatch using obs and there's no links needed all you need is your search engine uh, your hands a keyboard a mouse a, i mean a computer and just you know your brain i mean it's pretty simple I guess and what we're gonna do is just search out the timer you want so I'm just gonna search up two minute timer or just two timer because I cannot type and now we're gonna go click on the link and now once you're on this link head on over to OBS and holy crap okay so now once you're in OBS you're gonna click on the add button and you're going to go to window capture and you guys can see over here I'm going to just click OK and we're going to select chrome.exe over here and we're going to press ok once that's done um just you can see that this image is on your screen now what you're going to do is hold down the alt key and crop around the stopwatch now once you're doing that it's going to basically act like it's just a timer and not the whole browser and this makes it look like you have your own timer on your screen oh let's put that Please. Oh my god. Double click on the timer and drag it to your desired location. And once that's done, it's pretty simple. Head on over to your stopwatch and click set and start. And on the top left corner, you'll be seeing what you want to see. But here's the tricky part. In order for this to work and save time, you cannot open up another tab on your on your Chrome or it's going to show a different thing. So if I search up for example, I'm on this tab and I go here, it's going to show the gray screen. So what you want to do is you want to stay on this tab and now you can, it'll stay there. So this is like because it's capturing your windows. Now all you're going to do is if, for example, you're going to play video games or you're going to browse something else, just click and create a new window or just stick. So just drag here, click that, all right? And the timer will still be going on while you are browsing on something else. So if I was playing Fortnite or whatever, it would still show up. So if I was going to settings per se, it would still be there. But you cannot browse on the same tab that you opened up or in the same window that you opened up the timer. So with that said, that's basically it of the video. So if you guys like this kind of content, just feel free to like and subscribe. And if you guys really liked the video, just comment down below what you think I could do better. And if you guys have any questions, thanks for watching this video and stay tuned.